Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing a massive ASOS haul for you all. I think I've got around 200 to 250 pounds worth of stuff here. Um, I didn't buy it all in one go, I got it over three deliveries but the last one just arrived today so I'm going to open that one, kind of show you what I've got. I've got a mixture of shoes, clothing items, um, some summer, some winter uh, and yeah let's just get started. So I am going to be trying all of these things on for you um, and you'll see with the inserts of the try on clips as I talk about the, the items that I've got. So I will start off with some of the older pieces and then I'll get into some of the newer pieces that actually just arrived. All of the item links will be in the down bar. Um, this jumper that I've got on right now is from New Look if you're wondering. Um, I got it a long time ago but I think they still have it. It's from their concession line, Cameo Rose, and I got it in a size large. Anyway, I'm gonna have a chat with you about all of the stuff that I've got. And uh, I think most of the stuff that I got was in a size 18. So I got it from the straight sizes. Usually I always order from the curve section but I know that I've spent quite a few parcels back because things have been too big they've been really generous on sizes so I'll, I'll explain what I mean in a minute when I show you the clothes but I'll start with shoes first and um, you might have already seen these on my Instagram it's Hannah Hart X if you want to follow me on there um but it's these oh nearly dropped them um capped toe combat style boots or chunky boots so this is what they look like they're not actually from the asos brand they're from river island i got them on sale so let me just pop one down on my knee um but this is what they look like you can see they've got actually a really sturdy capped toe um and a small little chunky heel and they are croc leather um these are so comfortable i've not had to break them in you know they don't hurt at all and they were 22 pound 50 on asos and i think they're even cheaper now so they're absolutely amazing they look good with everything um so grab yourselves a pair of those so the next pair of shoes that i got i saw these on the kitty looks on instagram and absolutely fell in love with them so if you watched my primark haul which is the last video that i did you might have seen some gucci inspired loafers um, with a t-bar on the front and then I got these shoes here so these just like a small sandal they're in wide fit and they are a size six um, but they've got the same t-bar on them and again really really comfortable they've got a little bit of padding on the sole as well but they do look really really smart with just dresses or trousers or whatever it is that you want to wear them with and these are only 19.99 and they're from new look so again they're not from the own ASOS brand but um yeah they're really really comfortable i might insert a picture of the gucci ones if i can find one um that they're inspired by but they're a t-bar my throat is hurting so much um that's why i sound a bit croaky but yeah uh the ones from gucci are a t-bar sandal so they've got like a little strap up the top as well I, like i said i will insert a picture if i can find one but these are 19.99 and i just love these i think they're amazing so my next shoe is an a knee-high boot um, I saw these on a YouTuber, I can't remember her name, it's an American YouTuber, I think it's Jessica Torres, if I'm saying that right, but they're a ruched pair of knee-high boots, so they're not over the knee, they're just knee-high, but um, I think they're supposed to be that baggy look, but I've got thick calves, so they're not baggy on me at all, they're kind of tight, but they do fit me and I think they do look pretty nice, they are pointed to and I've been looking for a pair of knee high not over the knee knee high pointed toe boots with a block heel that isn't too high and this is exactly kind of the right size for me i can't walk in anything higher than that um but they are really really nice and they're on sale at the moment i will show you in the try on clip wearing them with like a skater dress or something the only thing is this one of the shoes i don't know what's happened to it I've, can you see it? it's like dug in and i can't actually get it to come out and when i put my foot in it, it's still like that so it's like a crease at the front i don't know if it's a defect or something but they've got a half zip on one side and yeah i like these they are really really pretty on so i'll just quickly mention these accessories um before i move on to the clothing items i bought oh my god i bought this belt i can't i don't think i can show it to you you'll have to see it in the try on but this is what it looks like it's got two gold snakes on it let's see if you can actually see that old school youtube style um two snakes on it gold chain belt i think it's on sale i got it for full price but it's now on sale but 
it is really nice um and i think it can just judge up an outfit i also got another chain belt and this is the one that kind of everybody on instagram is wearing i got this back i think christmas time um so this is quite a while ago this particular item but because it's still on the website i thought i would show it to you because it's still available but it is this chain belt this is what it looks like oh see if i can show you there you go um so very kind of chunky chain um like i said you can see it in the try on but it really does look so nice with like a slip dress i think that's how i wore it the first time is i put on a slip dress and then put that chunky chain on top of it chain belt on top of it and it looked really really cute um so i think that is it for the shoes and the accessories i don't really get a lot of accessories from asos but usually because they're all sold out all the time but i'll move on to clothing items i've got cat hair on my face somewhere <laughs> okay um so i'll move on to clothing items the first clothing item i've got is a pair of leather leggings now i've wore these to death um i think i've had them maybe a month and i have wore them to death so this is what they look like they're like a shiny obviously they're for leather they're like a shiny leather um or shiny for leather they're very very stretchy as you can see um and they are quite thin as well so that makes them really, really comfortable. If you want a thicker leather, these aren't for you. They were £22, but I think they just look great with everything. The only thing that I don't like about them is that they're a little bit baggy on the bottom. Now, I got these in a size 18. And I remember I ordered these in two sizes up. Um, but I would probably say a size down if you're going to get these because they are quite stretchy and I think it will look nice on the leg if they were a bit tighter at the bottom. I tend to roll these ones up so um, it doesn't matter that they're baggy at the bottom because I'm rolling them up anyway so you can't actually tell. But if I was to wear them down they wouldn't look too good because like I said they are baggy on the bottom so I would probably suggest you to size down on these ones from your normal size. Okay, so the next item I've got to show you is the same item in two different colours. If you know me, you know if I find something that I like, I'm going to buy it in every colour available. Um, so, oh my eye. Got something in it. So, um, this is the item. Can you see it in the black? Maybe I'll show you it in the green, but I'll try both on in the try on. So, I got this recently. This is from my recent parcel. Um and it is a high neck smock dress and it's got like a dipped waist so the waist kind of dips at either side um long sleeve and i think this just looks really really cool with chunky boots and like a sheer tie now i've also got it in the black now i don't think you'll be able to see the black there's probably loads of cat hair on it as well um but i've wore the black one before and because i really like the black one i bought the green one as well um and the black one will look so cute with you know those on trend spotty tights i think they're available on asos um as well so um i got those i think they were 18 pounds each but i just absolutely love smock dresses so i got those um and then i also bought another smock dress and this is from my new parcel um and I will show you that. So it looks so bright on camera. Oh my God. Okay. It looks really bright on camera. Um, so it's actually like a powdered blue. It looks really bright on camera. Let me see if I put it a bit closer. If it will show the true colour. No. It looks extremely bright on camera. It's not this bright. It's like a baby blue. Maybe in the try it will look different. Um, but again, it's a smock dress. Got this one recently. Um, by the way, those last two were in a size 18. This one is in a 16 because I've tried it on in the pink before and it was absolutely huge. And if I feel like this one is going to be big as well. I mean, look at look at that. That is big. So maybe you might have to size down a few sizes on this, maybe two sizes than your original size um, for this particular dress. It's short sleeve. It's got a little frill on the sleeve, but it's really big. Um, it is. It seems like it's a bit see-through. I'm not sure. But I think this one's going to look really cute in the summer. Um, maybe with some white trainers. I don't really wear trainers, but maybe. Um, but yeah, this I think was about £18 again, maybe. Don't quote me on that. Check in the description box for the link if you want it. And that will give you the price. But yeah, really nice dress. Next, I have this item, which I am in love with. So nice. I love pink, as you can see. Um... I got this 
so it looks like a normal you know thin knit jumper but then but bam if you look at the bottom of it it's just so cute oh my god this is the cutest jumper ever it's got a pink polka dot on it and it has short sleeves and it just looks like it's going to be so flattering hit you at the waist type um but the color is gorgeous and you know hopefully in the try on portion it will just be as nice as it looks you know by just looking at it um and this is from new look on asos in a size 18 and it doesn't have the price on it so that's great i think this was maybe again around the 20 pound mark um but i just think it's so cute look at it it's so pretty so cute this one so hopefully that looks really really cute on as well we'll have to see in the try on and then you can let me know if you think it looks nice in the comments below so i've got two more things left and these are from my recent parcel so from today's parcel this is one of them this is the asos design linen oversized jacket with contrast stitching got it because put that back to the side i got it because it's in this greeny color oh my god this looks like it's gonna be big oh it's got shoulder pads i hate shoulder pads so much um oh it looks really long i don't think i'm gonna like this i mean i love the color of it but oh look how long it is it's so long it's like a coat it's not like a blazer like it looks really long we'll have to see in the try on what it looks like but it's got lining in it it's a really thick linen as well so i think you know transitioning from you know winter to spring it's going to be really good for that i'd probably take the the shoulder pads out if i was going to keep it but we'll have to see what it looks like it's got a little button not button little pocket on the top i don't know if you can even see it and these tortoiseshell buttons it's also got pockets and they are real pockets um but like like i said we'll have to see what it looks like this was 40 pounds from asos so a bit more expensive than everything else but oh this is so nice the color is gorgeous especially for um spring summer because oh, did i just move my camera shoot um especially for spring summer because it seems that green is going to be the color of the season sage green powdered blue etc so speaking of powdered blue i got another blazer oh why is it coming up this color like it's a bright vibrant neon blue it's not it's like literally a duck egg blue this is such a pretty duck egg blue color Hopefully, again, it, like I said, in the try-on, it will come up as the colour that it actually is. Let me see. If I put it so close to the camera, will it make a difference? No. Maybe if I hold it to the side. It is kind of showing off like what it is, but it's a lot lighter than this. It's like a, a duck egg blue, and this is from Misguided. So, I'll show you the blazer. You can't really see it. You have to really see it in the try-on, won't you? Um, but this is from Misguided it's a granddad blazer again and the thing is with this one i have tried it before um i actually uh ordered this blazer from the real misguided website um and i ordered it in a 22 and a 20 and both of them were humongous and horrendous if you follow me on instagram you will have seen them on my instagram stories so they actually came out with this on asos as well and i ended up ordering it in a size 16 it's the co-ord oversized granddad blazer size 16 so i ordered this in a size 16 and i'm hoping that it will look a lot better i usually wear my my blazers open anyway i don't ever close them i think they look you know too formal when they're closed so um if it doesn't close i'm not too bothered but i ordered it in a 16 because the 20 and the 22 the, the arms were too long they were too baggy it's got shoulder pads as well i'll probably rip these shoulder pads out because i hate shoulder pads um i think they make you look really like you know bulky and not too good um but yeah this is a gorgeous color i just hope it looks nice and you'll see on the try on if i'm gonna keep it i'll give it a thumbs up or i'll give it a thumbs down we will see um but i think guys that is the end of the haul so it's been quite a long one um i personally i'm enjoying 
you know, watching people's hauls, especially since we are all, you know, inside at the moment as well. Um, so I'm doing a lot of online shopping because I'm not able to go outside and shop. Um, unfortunately, I'm still working, so I'm still going to work for the next week and we are teaching remotely to our students. Um, but yeah, just stay safe, guys, and hopefully you enjoy this video. If there's any suggestions of things that you want to see, maybe lookbooks. I don't know if that's a thing anymore. Like I said, I haven't been on YouTube for like seven years. So back then, I used to do loads of lookbooks, but now I don't really see people doing lookbooks. Oh, look, and my neighbor's looking at me. Um, now I don't really see people doing lookbooks. So is that a thing? I don't know. You let me know um, if you want to see anything specific. All of these clothes, like, I can get used after them showing you kind of how to style them maybe or something along those lines but anyway hope you enjoyed this video and if you did please give it a thumbs up comment in the comment section and please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already more videos coming up especially with this quarantine period i reckon i'll be filming quite a bit more so yeah anyway thank you guys for watching and hope you have a brilliant day and week and i'll see you next time Bye bye